viewers, subscribers, Kingdom Saints, making a little short video on why it is so important to come to Jesus or and to stay in Jesus. You know what I'm saying? To stay in Jesus, to stay chosen, to stay selected. If you look at what the world is doing right now, the state of uh, the state of turmoil that we're in, they're talking about making AI AI pastors, AI holograms of Jesus in the church, AI sermons, artificial intelligence. Why would you want to follow a hologram or AI that doesn't have conviction? That can't give you testimonies of the goodness of, and the glory of the Lord. You know what I'm saying? This is all leading to the mark of the beast. This is all. They, they want you to worship and praise artificial intelligence. You know what I'm saying? They, they want to have it so you can go online and have an online artificial intelligence pastor. Or, or an artificial intelligence intelligence hologram of Jesus, you know what I'm saying? This is just preparation for the mark of the beast where Revelation say they shall worship the beast. That's what the beast wants. Wants you to worship him. Because Satan is so jealous of God. So jealous. He he doesn't want anyone to praise and worship God. He is jealous to the T with a capital J. And also they're talking about eliminating the dollar. I just went on YouTube yesterday and saw uh, America is 1.8 trillion in debt in credit cards. They're talking about eliminating credit cards, eliminating the dollar. Mm, this is also a sign of the mark of the beast because I said no man can buy and sell without the mark. And they also uh, and they've been talking about this, the New World Order. They've been talking about that since the 1970s. Bush, all the presidents was talking about a New World Order. And that's uh, also been prophesied in Revelations that there will be a New World Order where it's going to be one nation all the worlds will be under one nation, one new world order, and you won't be able to buy or sell without the mark. You won't be able to buy or sell if you don't concur and conform to their degrees, to their laws, you know what I'm saying? So this is all a way of total global domination. And that evil one is a clever little foe. But we already know ahead of time what, what he's doing. Because God tells us, you know what I'm saying? God tells us everything about our enemy. And it's it's him who appoints kings and queens. It's him who brings them down as well. He has all power and all authority. He brings up the evil ones. And he brings down the evil ones. Because America is being punished for what they choose to do. America is being punished for the choices they make, and disobeying God. He brings up great ones, and he brings up the evil ones. It's all God's plan. It's all in God's plan. And everybody should know that Jesus is coming soon, you know? And everything that you have in this world right now, including your family, your friends, your wife, your husband, is temporary, but Jesus is permanent. See, I need to get on the Jesus train. People, get ready. Get the train of someone. Scriptures also tells us that um, there will be lawlessness abound. Lawlessness abound everywhere you go. There will be lawlessness abound. If you um look at the world right now, see lawlessness is everywhere. There's lawlessness everywhere. Crime is running rampant. I just saw something on YouTube about somebody who went on a stabbing spree. You know, 
and there's gun violence. There's all kinds of things going on right now. You know what I'm saying? So um, life is not guaranteed. Nobody knows when they're going to go. You know what I'm saying? This is a crazy world we're living. People are just dying for no reason at all. Because these dark souls dwelling on innocent lives, you know what I'm saying? So we, um, like we used to say in the day, a stray bullet ain't got no name on it. So uh, it's just a dark world we live in right now. And we all need the light of Jesus. We all need that hope, that assurance that only he can provide us the hope and assurance of eternal life with Christ Jesus. Jesus said, I go to prepare a place for you. In my Father's house are many mansions. I go to prepare a place for you so that you can be with me forever. Those are encouraging words to every Christian in this world right now. You know what I'm saying? Those are encouraging words because we have that hope. We have that assurance. And we have that oneness with Jesus that we will have when we depart from this earth. You know what I'm saying? Because we are just vessels right now. We will spy God to do his will to preach the, preach the gospel to all the nations. And when that is done, when the world is evangelized and the church is complete, it is Jesus in the, in the air that we shall meet. And we shall give him a warm embrace when we see him face to face. And he's going to take us with him to the, that heavenly place. Amen. Amen. Okay, that's, a, that's just my short message. Don't forget to subscribe. And remember, one faith. One faith. One baptism. One God. And y'all don't forget to hit the like button. Yeah. Hit that like button there, boy. Love you all, my kingdom saints. Thanks for watching. <laughs>